And yes, this is how the game starts because the opening cutscene is actually like the opening cutscene. So yeah, we start the game with him falling through the sky instead of like, you know, the big climactic battle when he gets sent into space. <laughs> That's what we're all wondering. Hey, At least this has subtitles okay. in it, you know? What in the world? <laughs> what is Chip thinking about, bruh? Huh? Oh, uh, we all know okay. that. Nothing broken. Maybe I can fix the audio a bit. No, I'm just fine. Thanks for asking, Mr. Monster Guy. There, we good Mr. now. Monster Guy? Looks like things have gotten pretty ugly. There. Yeah, look at those teeth <laughs> and those claws. True, the teeth. What's your name anyway? I'm Sonic. Sonic, Sonic the Hedgehog. And you are? Chip. I am like uh, Gaia. Uh, I, don't know. I, I can't remember! <laughs> what? You forgot who you are? <laughs> yep. I remember something falling from the sky. And everything just going all white. I'm Shadow. Then, He's Shadow in this game. I can't remember a thing past that. Did Sonic just break the fourth wall? Where do I go from here? What a life! <laughs> hey, don't worry. I'll help you get your memory back. Really? Do you mean it? Absolutely. I'm sure we'll find. Am I the only one that thought the graphics around. would be like this? Oh, thank you. You're the best, Mr. Monster. I'm not joking about this. Sonic, My first time playing this game, I thought that the game would look like this. But I didn't really care about graphics at all. Like, I was just like, this is awesome. And, you know, I, I really didn't question it. Like, why the cutscenes were different. For all I knew, it was CGI. Even though it turned out to be in game graphics. <laughs> Here we go, and our story begins. Okay, so what we're gonna be doing here is exploring the town. <laughs> oh yeah, if you drift too much, that's what happens. That that's literally what happens. Like the voice clips overlay each other. If you're wondering, the game does not restrict you when it comes to you know metals. Like when it comes to the metals, you are not restricted. Period. Press it again. Yeah, but the medals, you don't have to have a specific amount. You can just go through the game. These are just for, like, unlockables and extras, basically. Alright, let's go. Let's do this. Let's just... I'm gonna play like a normal person. I know. I gotta boost into them. Sweet. 
I really love this game. <laughs> I just love it. Oh yeah, and if you're wondering what that loud noise is, if you can hear it, that's basically the PS2, the PS2 fan. The fan of the PS2 is pretty loud, you know, but I gotta sit right next to my TV in order to record, so what can I do about it? Mm -hmm. All right, all right. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> Why do I love doing that? Okay, let me get up. <laughs> These tutorial levels, trust me, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm debating on editing them out. All right, all right, all right. The moment of truth. Dude, this is so exhilarating. Like, uh, dude, this is so fun. <laughs> that little kick at the end. <laughs> <Just> freaking... <gasps> S rank. <laughs> First S in the game. It always feels good. It feels great doing that though, like for real. <laughs> all about the hair and those arms and and look at the chaos emeralds <laughs> the so, hair and those arms and think about the chaos emeralds <laughs> yeah this is the real me pretty cool huh <laughs> where'd you go looks good don't it mm -hmm. That there chocolate chip cream sundae supreme is the pride of the city. <laughs> the whole world can come tumbling down, but they'll still light up for a taste. No, they won't. Mm -mm -mm. Hey! What about your memories? Uh, chocolate chip sundae supreme. <laughs> you said it. Enjoy it, kiddo. Satisfaction guaranteed. If you don't love it, you get your money back. Hey! Oh. I love it. They don't have money. How did they get that for free? Wow, this chip whatever stuff is great. You say so. How about you give me a hand and help look for somebody who knows you, Chip? Chip? Gotta call you something, don't I? What do you think? Yeah, Chip. Chip, I love it. Yum. Now, what do you say we start asking around and see if anybody here knows you? Okay. Hmm. <laughs> all right. So what we do here is we talk and then we answer questions and all that. This doesn't really matter. So we can practically skip through all of this if we want it. You know. All right. We got him out of the way. Yes, I know, the ones that I can actually talk to, they're there, but I gotta do this, you know. It'll help me in the long run, you know, getting to all the other Gaia Gates. Okay, so this is where they're actually gonna ask you questions and where you're gonna answer. Or, no one's gonna be here, pretty much. So basically, you're forced to talk to them, because if someone's not there, you have to pass your time, or else you're not gonna be able to do anything.
sure which way. And here's where we go to the other stage. And the guy gate unlocks. Yeah. You see this. You see it. And basically, he's giving you the rundown of the guy gates, and it's familiar to him, basically. And he's giving you the key. Did I forget to mention that I love this game? <laughs> that door's glowing. Let's go. I find it kind of weird how he doesn't really notice, like, anything weird about that. Am I the only one who thinks that they should have done an Archie Sonic Unleashed comic? Like, that was perfect comic material right there. You know, that would have settled the issue with, you know, them not being able to use the whole, you know, Archie Comics characters due to the lawsuit. All they had to do is ask Sega permission to use Sonic Unleashed characters and concepts, and there you go. Everything would have been solved. And you notice those ten rings? Yeah, those are actually good, you know? I could have actually kept up that action chain. I could have actually held that action chain for way longer. Hey dude, I was grinding on an invisible wall there. <laughs> It was acting as if I was grinding on a left wall or something. Dude, why am I trying to sync up with the music here? Like, it's just, it's fun. It's just fun screwing around in this game. Like, it really is. And you notice how the boost gauge just levels up and gets longer and bigger as we keep going? That's what I love about this game. It doesn't give you a constant boost like the other versions do, you know? It's like, hey, you gotta conserve your boost in order to get somewhere in this, you know? It's not just total boost to win fashion, you know? And that's mainly because, you know, boost to win was not really thought of in this game, you know? Like, it really wasn't thought of, like, period. I can do this. We can make it there in time. <laughs> Look at it. I'm gonna get an S rank. We're totally getting an S rank. What did I tell you? What did I say? And you can actually explore the area back there. That's not empty. It's really not empty, okay? Just felt I needed to tell you that. Illustration. A hundred rings! 
hundred rings, hundred rings. <laughs> Dude, if anyone's been on my channel like for years, you know what I'm talking about. My Sonic 2, my freaking Sonic 2 video. A hundred rings, a hundred rings, a hundred rings. Tails, what are you doing? You're wasting my rings. <laughs> You're wasting my rings. You're wasting my rings. You're wasting my rings. Tails! Yeah, whatever. I got this. Loop the loop. Then we good. One moon medal? That's because no one Don't knows you other than me. Maybe your memory will come back on its own. Remember anything yet? Because you're a god, you know? <laughs> you're oh, well. freaking god, man. Oh. Oh. Rabies! You're oh. kicking in! <laughs> Whoa, Mr. Monster Guy is back. Uh, so when the sun goes down, I, I turn, turn into, into this. this? <laughs> Are you okay, Sonic? I'm fine. I just need to be careful who sees me like this. Sonic, Sonic, look. What is it? Oh, it's hopeless. Oh, I have crippling depression. <laughs> Mr. Krusty hey, Krab is unfair. Hey, Mr. Krabs is in there standing at the concession. I have crippling depression. Good as ice cream at a time like this. Even when the sun falls apart, people will still be here. I'm a rubber man. If no one knows that, that that was a One Piece reference, you know the four kids One Piece. <laughs> Jesus, stop it! Get some help. Basically, everyone's feeling weird right now, so we gotta ask them. You know, go around, talk to them. We gotta talk to these people, you know? That's the only way we're gonna do something. <laughs> you know, nobody thinks I'm Sonic anymore. They like, yo, you a monster. What happened? <laughs> They're all just like, stop it. Get some help. <laughs> I'm Michael Jordan. For some reason, this music is just soothing. Like, I don't know. It's, it's something about it, man. Like, okay. No, I'm not playing the HD version, by the way. I'm never going to play that version on this channel. Just letting you know that. He's seen Tails, so I gotta go find him. You know, I gotta go save him. And now we got that key. Get the key to the gate. Also, this is a lot faster to beat, which is a plus in my book, because I do not play long. I do not like playing long games. They, they're, they're just so time consuming. I kind of, I actually, I actually like short and sweet games. Okay, I can't do long games because I get bored of them very fast. You know, it's like let's say it was a longer Sonic game. Well, whatever, I can do that. You know, I can play that, but you know. When it comes to like different kinds of games, like if it's Sonic, yeah, I can play it because it's longer and it won't be the same level over and over again. It won't feel like the same thing over and over again. But with other games, especially open world, I feel like I'm doing nothing but the same, you know? It's all the same. And that's sort of like where my gripes come in with those, you know, genres. Move the 
Yeah, I know, I know, I know what to do. <laughs> Sun medal. Yeah, I know what to do. You can climb up. I'm just rushing this tutorial like completely. Yeah, but do, you you know that you know that little thing that you just saw, like the leveling wheel. It's better than leveling up the system in the HD version. You can actually use that wheel to get skills. You don't have to spend experience and points. It automatically does it for you. Am I the only one that feels the werehog was sort of cool? Like, it was almost cool. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. Now that was a quick tutorial. <laughs> Man. Okay, now we're gonna do this the right way. You can what Okay. You can actually run into boxes and break them in this game. When you're throwing boxes, it almost auto-aims, but it's like, it's good, you know? Alright, 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 that was cleared. And I got my medal. Let's move on. Oh yeah, by the way, um, <laughs> when Sonic Forces comes out, it's the same day that my mom gets paid, so basically, I'm, I'm gonna have that game. Like on the same day trust me i i won't be like you know like what i've been doing before the game came out before the game comes out i mean you know like i'm actually gonna turn my brain off and actually play it you know turn my brain off and actually have fun <laughs> Oh, oh, you wanna, you wanna fight me? You wanna fight me? I got boxes. Don't worry, don't worry, I got some boxes. I am got a box. Eat. Anything up here? No. I'm gonna need that. Thank you very much. He progressively gets faster. Don't worry. Okay, I gotcha, I gotcha, I gotcha. No button matching required, just hold it. Oh, I thought there was something over there. Oh, these guys. Pick these little fluff balls up and throw them. There. Oh yeah, the more enemies I kill, the more combos I unlock, so you know. I'm just trying to get that. Trying to get the combos. You know, get the get the combos. Kills. Now I gotta get three keys. Yeah, I know what these are. Don't worry, don't worry, I know what to do. I'm locked out. Well, guess what? I'm gonna have to break in. 
Oh yeah, and L... I believe either R1 or L1 is literally your Unleash, your unleashed Gauge. That's how you activate that. No, 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 L1 is your Unleashed Gauge, actually. Alright. This is literally the only combo that I can have until I level up, you know? Like, three hit combos with either square or circle. Oh yeah, uh, did I tell you guys I have a thing for backtracking sometimes? Like, I accidentally do that. It's like, hey, hey, I've been, I've been through this. Oh crap, where do I go? And it's like, I literally take a full-on U-turn, and I just get sidetracked. Oh yeah, Full Metal Alchemist on PS2? I'm thinking of doing that, but I'm not sure if I can actually, you know, record that consistently, you know? So it's like, I'd have to probably break that... I'd have to break up my recordings, and I'll be like, two recording sessions is one part, basically. Like, that, that's the kind of thing I'd have to do, because it's an RPG, you know? Like, I haven't played RPGs on my channel, so I don't know what formula I'm gonna do. You know? Like, I'm probably gonna do that. Because, trust me, it takes a while to get anywhere in Fullmetal Alchemist 2 on the PS2. Like, when I tell you... It takes a while. It takes a while. Let me go up here real quick. He, he wouldn't even run for a second. Nothing. Alright, we good. Everything's gravy. Let's go. Let's do this. One. And now let's go to this door. It is now unlocked. So we just broke it. Come on. Come on. Yep. I got you. I got you. Yes, I'm going to be taking a lot of damage, by the way, because, you know, not a lot of combos. Alright, we good. <laughs> oh god, I can't get out of here. Hold on. Okay. Let's go, that only took four minutes. I got an S rank, most likely. A. The target time was six, but I made it there within four. How? How? Hold on, the target time was six, but I made it in within four. So, how does that screw me up? No, seriously, how does that screw me over? It, it, that was the target time. Shoo! Missions! Every other version sucks balls, except for the Wii and PS2, because they're not fun, you know? Like, Sonic sucks. The Werehog sucks. Like, HD as a whole, it just sucks. No like, for me, at least. Let's get on that button. And by the way, I'm using a PS1 controller to play this game. 
Yeah, I said it. I'm using my PS1 controller. My trusty PS1 controller. My ocean blue one. Hey, I didn't know that that was an actual place you can go. Well, <laughs> the more you know. Now this is where boxes come in handy. This is where the boxes come in handy. Like literally, th these people are annoying. And you wonder where the health bar from Sonic Boom came from? This Sonic. is where the health bar came from. That is a bottomless pit. Do not think of it, okay? Don't think that something's down there like last time. Like in the tutorial part. Because you will be mistaken. I love that sound effect. <laughs> I just love that sound effect. I don't know why. But let's go. Yes, this will be part one. All of this in its entirety. Just trying to check for any secrets that I might have missed when I was younger and everything. Be okay. <laughs> for a second, it would not let me do it, even though I was holding it. Like, even though I was holding it to move forward. Crap. Sometimes it gets a little finicky. Hold on, let me let me open that door. What am I doing? <laughs> I almost forgot some precious, some precious orbs. All right, some precious experience. B. Let me up. Let me up. You gotta be. I, I think the only way to get S ranks is to beat it fast, kill a lot of enemies, and that's it, you know? You know, beat it fast enough, kill enough enemies, and you know, all that, all that good stuff, you know? Find most of the items. I mean, I don't think they require you to find everything, but yeah, there is a target time for these. But even if you even if you make the target time, you're not guaranteed an S rank. So, see, that's why I'm just running around like it literally. Okay, so it allows ex it allows exploration and it rewards you for it. You know, that's kind of what I like about this game. Like, of course they slowed the game down, but it's like, but it's like, they're rewarding you for going slow this time, you know? And it's not like they're, you're going too fast to be able to explore, like, the other games, you know? It's that perfect balance of speed, you know? Not too slow, not too fast.
let me put that lever. We gonna get in the elevator. And let's go. Let's go. It's box time. Time to use the skills they taught me. <laughs> oh, someone just broke into my house. Might as well throw something. Yes, the Unleash Gauge does not work. The Unleash Gauge does not activate other combos until you actually unlock the combos. So yes, what I just did, see. That's the only new thing that they unlocked. That's the only new thing that you have with the Unleash Gauge as of now. These bees are annoying. Like, trust me, the bees, they're so annoying. Whoa, 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 whoa. Was there an item there? It couldn't have been. Oh, yeah, this part where you get to... Eh. I gotta be careful with that because sometimes it gets, like, a little buggy and it doesn't want to work. But, you know... We gotta get the items. We can't forget these. Phew! Dude, I'm right on the thing! Phew! Oh my god, dude. They almost screwed me over. Like, I was right on the thing when he said that. The target time was 7, but I spent a little bit more time than I needed to, you know? And this is, this is Act 2. Yeah, man, we got Acts in this game. Let's go. Look at all them secrets. You wouldn't have dared to look there, would you? No, you wouldn't. <laughs> yes, they're hiding things from you. You know, you gotta actually look for these, you know? They feel so good to collect too, you know? Like, just that sound effect. See, look at that combo. This is the only combo that you can do until you... Yes, this is the only combo you can do until you unlock more moves. Just letting you know that. The game isn't this bare-boned, okay? It gets better, trust me. It gets way better. I mean, what do you expect? This is the beginning of the game. Ugh.
Wait a minute. Is there something on the roof there? Oh, never mind. It's an invisible wall. Ah, mother. Oh yeah, the good thing about this version is that instead of a run button, you literally just have access to it at all times. Like, no button required. Just rapidly do that joint, you know, the analog stick, and there you go. Yes, they also count up your combos too, so if your combo chains are really weak, you have a lower possibility of getting an S rank. They gotta be hiding something from me back here. So, yeah, they were. I've sort of learned this game inside and out actually, so yeah. Get show. No. Hold on, hold on, hold on. There's gotta be something around here. We can't forget those, those, those areas. The bootleg got a war thing that they pulled off. It's actually pretty fun when you get over the fact that it's not Sonic, you know? All right, let's get out of here. Oh, crap. Yeah. Screwed me.
Look at all that stuff we got. Look it. Tails is in danger. Let's save him. No, you mean Sonic's Tornado 1. Sonic was the one who owned the Tornado 1. Tails made the Tornado 2. And now we will be visiting Spagonia later on, okay? 